Today, we bring you a collection of the dumbest products we could find worldwide. We've been collecting them for years, and today, the moment has finally arrived for another dumb product. Suck, 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 suck. First, we have a submission from a friend, mm. Christina P. This is the hander pants. It's underpants for the hand. Yes. And what is the purpose of hander pants? According to the package, it's for supermodels, construction, cooking, cooking, cr cruising, <laughs> the elderly. Oh my god. And night blogging. Night blogging? Why can't you blog during the day with the underpants <laughs> on your hands? Why only night blogging? Okay, so we've got one glove on, tidy whities Feels pretty snug, pretty good. What happened? One's on <laughs> front ways. Did I do the wrong pants? Um, yeah, let me dress you, Ethan. It's kind of cute, I'm not gonna lie. So, again, like... <laughs> I'm getting pretty fresh ideas here. <laughs> I want to goof on it, because it's <laughs> underwear for the pants. But it actually is pretty snug. It feels pretty good. <laughs> it does. I'm definitely going to be planning on doing some heavy night blogging. Isn't the function of underwear like if you are like have a couple of drips left after peeing or something or to contain mm. the stink? That I mean, I've, I've, I've kind of always wondered what really is the oh, function of underwear. Oh, what about like after you eat and you just want to do like a little mm. to wipe? Yeah, it's like a streak stain for your <laughs> mouth. Okay, I get it. Well, this is good for me because my hands actually secrete. Um, I have a, a condition that I have sw stinky sweat. What? I don't know. Some people actually do have that condition. <laughs> but you don't. Yeah, I don't. Next up, we got the shittens. And it's just like baby wipes. It's like a glove. It's a full <laughs> glove for wiping. Uh, who wipes with their whole hand <laughs> is what says, I'm wondering. Patent pending. Right. So don't think of stealing the right, idea. Right. They're already working on it. And it's fragrance free. Oh good. So it's safe for babies and stuff. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's disgusting. <laughs> First of all, I'm not taking my No. <laughs> what is it called? Um, under 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 pants. Whoa, whoa. No, hand Fragrance pants. free. I smell something. I don't something. think so. That stinks. It that smells like that bleach. is that is awful. I mean, let me just feel what that would feel like, because it would be like... Yeah. You only, it's too you, gross. You only get one wipe. Like, yeah, if you go for one dirty it's such wipe, a waste. you can't like fold it up. You have, Maybe you use one finger, and then you move on to the next finger. It's you, gross. And I would like to know who wipes with their whole hand. Can you imagine? You're like, you're just scooping it out with your whole hand. They're apparently saying you can use it for baby, for pets, for grandpa? And for you. Poor grandpa, can you imagine? <laughs> All right, grandpa, it's time to clean up. This is for the only the most deadliest clean. Another product in the world of wiping and then we can move on. Either we have so many wiping related products. I know. Is this by design? Well, you do talk about wiping like every day. True, I'm a connoisseur. This is the comfort wipe. Um, it extends your reach for better cleaning. So, what? <laughs> extend your reach for better cleaning. Who, is this yes. for like really big people? Like you, like you, like you, like you. Soft and smooth cushion edge for added comfort. It has an ergonomic design for ease, comfort, and cleanliness. I'm not sure what you do with this. Is this Look really? at that. <laughs> okay, somebody explain this. That's disgusting, dude. It looks like a prolapse. <laughs> it doesn't want to make me put that anywhere near my butt. <laughs> Listen to the sound. It sounds like a prolapsing anus. You put toilet paper here, but yeah, and then and then it catches it there, but then you have to hold this down while you wipe. But it's really hard to hold down. According to the instructions, you. Bro, I don't need instructions to wipe <laughs> my ass. You know that's when it's gone too far. You need around six sheets. Fold it in half. Do not immerse this in the water, by the way. Ew, this is so <laughs> horrid. How do I get the toilet paper to stay in this prolapsed anus So I think, um, I think you roll it around it. Ew, how you can get a good clean like that? So I'm on the toilet. Yeah. Presumably I'm like 600 pounds because no, I can't imagine <laughs> any other purpose. The thing is you gotta get in the hole. 
when you're wiping. <laughs> Imagine you're actually using this and then... And then you gotta touch it to get rid of exactly. it. Exactly, so you've got all this shitty toilet paper and now you have to take it off like that. Put it in the toilet. This is ergonomic design for ease, comfort, and cleanliness. It's soft and smooth, cushioned and for added comfort. It's so. basically the opposite of everything I <laughs> just said. It's not easy, it's not comfortable, and it's not clean. <laughs> it's not easy. This is probably, in all seriousness, the worst product. <laughs> There's nothing fun, like self-aware or funny about it. Look at that. Yeah. That's all you get. A prolapsing anus for your prolapsed anus. We can move on to the mouth. We got food. From one hole to another. Right, Ela? Yes. This is a hot dog slicer. Do you really need to eat it from a dog shaped? It's a wiener dog. I know, but like, do you really want to be reminded of an animal when you're eating a hot dog? I think it's really strapped in there, dude. Yeah. This is theft proof <laughs> packaging. <laughs> it's behind the glass. You gotta ask for a cashier. This is not fat. See, this is what it is not faster than slicing a dog. So the dog comes off thusly. The uh, dog is placed in the center thusly, and now it is show time. Now it is time for the show to finally begin. Show time. Okay. Now what? <laughs> Now what? You've thought of everything. So now when you take it off. Oh, great. Mmm. Tastes better. <laughs> it's kind of gross because you have to like get it all out of there. Ew. Look at that. Oh. <laughs> You're basically like eating the dog. You're right. Isn't it insane? It's pretty weird. It's like you're picking apart pieces from yeah. the dog and eating it. Next stop. Sometimes it gets cold here in LA, but not too cold. But um, you could always use a face blanket. You're going to have to explain to me what's a face blanket. How's that different than a towel? No. Okay, we'll get to that. But can you appreciate the packaging? It's just a plastic bag. Epic. <laughs> is that how it arrives? <laughs> just in a plastic bag? With this <laughs> Just this thing? That makes me really skeptical, <laughs> dude. There's Yo, <laughs> this is just a cloth with a hole in it. Where are you supposed to see from? Or okay, I'm gonna relax. <laughs> oh, am I supposed to be able to see through it? Is this how I use it? I guess you'll be too cold if you did that. You look, you look the idea my... is covering your face. Well, do you look my, my face blanket? No. Eyes go here. Oh, I look like a ninja or a or a person with a full body burka. I don't get it. What do I Me need a blanket neither. for? Just put a cloth on your face if you really need to protect. And how cold is it, by the way? Where is it so cold that you desperately need to cover your face with this? And if it's that cold, then this thing is not going to do anything. That's not enough. I feel like I just inhaled anthrax, dude. Why'd you put that on me? Great. The face blanket, ladies and gentlemen. This one we've been dreading doing for a long time, but you're gonna have to do it. The pimple picker. There's like a whole um, community for pimple popping. I mean, there's even a show on TLC now, Dr. Pimple yeah. Popper. This is something I've known people who are into this. There's people that are like, let me pop the pimples on your back. And that to me has, o has always just been something that I am deeply, deeply disgusted by. So you've got basically emulates human skin. You inject pus in it. It's just so gross. With this tool, and then you pop. Oh, this is so wrong. Why would anyone buy this? I'm so I disgusted by this. Apparently it's huge. Okay, you ready, Eva? Yeah. Ew, Ew. that's that's just disgusting, dude. Ew! Gross. Ew, I hate it. Oh, God, this takes me back to Gross. being a teenager. You ever pop a pimple like that on your face as a teenager? Yes, I did. Oh, dude. No, I forget. I, I, I don't I've, think I've, I ever had this much come out, though. I've stored these memories away in the hurt locker. 
I wanted to never remember the trauma of popping a pimple like this ever again, and here I am. Why would anyone want to bring this back? Now, Ela, it's your turn. You just gotta pop oh, that gross. pimple, dude. Don't you know how to pop a pimple? I mean, like this, right? Ooh, that's disgusting. Eat it. <laughs> yeah, right. You've got this pimple refilling. I mean, I wouldn't call this a dumb product because apparently people like, but it's just, it's disgusting. Maybe it is a dumb it product. It is a dumb product. I'm going to inject it back in to the crevice. Ew, feel that. It's like, ew. It's like lubricated, bro. Now it's all oily and greasy. And I just, look at Whoa. that. Whoa! You see who's oh got- Oh my god! Uh, you're surprisingly good at this, Ethan. You're not saying Don't anything? Don't do it. Don't do it. You know what's really messed up? There's some people watching that are actually going to go buy that yeah. and do that. Yeah. They love it. They're addicted. And no, you cannot pimp, pimple pop my back acne. Next up is the glow-in-the-dark toilet paper. Ooh. What the hell? Why would you want that? That's so horrible. If shit is like, in case you want to see your shit in the toilet bowl at night. Ela, do you look at your poop after you? Yes. You shit, you do. Always. And do you look on the first wipe? Yeah. You do. I do as well. Good to know. Every wipe I check. I also check almost every wipe. Maybe not the last few when I'm, it's almost out. This is the kind of toilet paper that I wouldn't wish on my worst enemy. <laughs> It's just, it's one ply. It's airport level. It's worse, I've never, this is just straight up sandpaper. Apparently, it's gonna glow. So that way you can still check your poop marks on the TP even when it's pitch black. I'm trying to charge it. I am mega charging the toilet roll. Yes. 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 We have charged the toilet paper. The light is, the camera is on the toilet paper. Go ahead and turn it off. Let's see what happens. Hmm. I guess there's a slight, a slight, a slight glow. Super slight glow. Not sure about this product here, guys. <laughs> this may qualify as dumb. <laughs> I really want to see what a load of glowing toilet paper looks like in the bathroom. I think it's important that everyone knows what that looks like. So we bought glow in the dark goo. And I'm gonna soak the toilet paper in this goo. And in the interest of science, I would like to see what a load of glowing turds looks like. Without further ado, -do, Ethan's load of glowing turds. What is the point of this? It's a load of glowing turds. What do you mean? Okay, here we go. <laughs> Get excited, everybody. Whoa, Ew, what? Wait, what is it on the seat? I didn't put that there. <laughs> what? Ew, what is that on the seat? That's horrifying. Does poop glow in the dark? I have seen it does. Ethan's famous load of glowing <laughs> turds. <laughs> Feast your eyes on this epic moment for all to enjoy. Whoa. Are you thrilled? I am thrilled, I'm not gonna lie. Are you excited? We lived through a pandemic so that we could watch turds glow in a toilet. Oh! <laughs> Hello, everybody. So nice here again. Alright, I think it's time to move on. We move on to the big finale. This I am not excited to use. I've been dreading this moment. So this is a portable sauna. Portable far infrared ray? I don't think infrared is dangerous. You want more kids, right? Yes. When using dry heat sauna, people are exposed to elevated temperatures. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can be fatal if you're fat. That's me. I feel like Houdini doing his <laughs> final trick. So how much was this? So this was $200. Wow. This is a big investment for me. Well, my first question is, well, who needs a sauna this bad? 
And it's portable, so use Bluetooth, like bring it with yeah. you. I just want you to know, okay. for the record, how unexcited I am about this. Please, God, keep me keep me uh, safe during these okay. difficult times. Well, how do I look, Eula? Uh, weird. Sad? Sad. Let's crank it up all the way, 150 degrees. Okay, so we've got the thermometer. We're at 110. If you have any vegetable broth and, and uh, garlic, throw it in. It feels good on my feet. Okay. Um, on my back, it's very warm. So there's no water involved in No, the, no, no. The Dry sauna, there. baby. The only water comes from your sweat. Shredder! Shredder, why do you want to come up so bad? All right, how long have we been, have we been in here? Do you have any idea how long I've been in here? Um, five? Like, ten? Maybe five minutes. <laughs> Why do you want to raise your temperature? I don't get the sauna. Feels good. It does it. I'm inside. <laughs> don't make me come over there. <laughs> 160, 155. Are you okay? <laughs> I, don't, I don't think so. I don't think I am. 175, it oh when my I came God. out. Wait, I'm cooking. What? You cook <laughs> stuff at that temperature, don't you? Oh my god. You gotta get out. <laughs> I don't trust this. Oh my god. Feel all the heat that's coming out of there. Do I smell cooked? <laughs> A nice <laughs> A little, little sear. Well, guys, I'm going my ways and I'm taking my sauna with me. I'll see y'all later. Excuse me, everybody. Alright, guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time, alright? Ta-ta!